In the winter, food can be hard for birds to come by. Use materials from your yard to make a wreath that feeds them and looks like a decoration. Here are some things you'll need. You'll want to use evergreen cuttings as the base of your wreath. Use your pruners to take short cuttings of thin branches. Look for conifers that have small cones on lower branches that are easy to reach, like eastern red cedar, arborvitae, and hemlock. You can also harvest any large pine cones that have fallen from the tops of trees like eastern white pine and Norway spruce. In winter, your garden should be full of faded perennials with seed heads. Look for seed heads with interesting shapes and textures, like those of purple cone flower or ornamental grasses. Take cuttings of trees and shrubs that bear fruit, like winterberry, crabapple, and beautyberry. Begin constructing your wreath by attaching cuttings of evergreens to the wreath ring. Line the cuttings against the wreath and secure them at the bottom with a piece of wire. Make sure to tuck the end of the wire in so it can't hurt the birds. Layer the cuttings on top of each other so that the end of one covers the base of another. Then begin adding cuttings of plants with seed heads, pine cones, and fruit. You can secure them with floral wire as well. You may also be able to tuck these materials into the evergreen base itself rather than tie them individually to the wreath. Be creative and think about colors and textures when placing your cuttings. For soft materials like sunflower seed heads and larger pine cones, Pierce them horizontally with floral wire, like you're using a sewing needle, and tie them on. You can also pierce them with floral picks and attach the pick to the wreath. Attach a ribbon on top to hang the wreath. Then hang it outside for the birds to feast on all winter long. 